Hello everyone and welcome to my tutorial on how to live stream to YouTube. First of all, we sign into Google. Then we open YouTube. Click My Channel. Click Video Manager. Then click Live Streaming. Then click on events. Then click on new live event. Then fill in the basic information, title, description and tags. Click Create Event. If you have an introductory image for your live event, you can click Browse on this page to select the thumbnail and then click Open. Select a bitrate. A list will open up for the various screen res resolutions. 720p should be 1500 kilobits per second to 4000 kilobits per second. Scroll down the page and under to export settings, click download profile primary. You can choose where it will download to. I sometimes create a file on the desktop and name it profiles and save the profile to it. Uh, having a file on the desktop will also remind me to delete the used profiles. Click Save Changes. At this stage you can click Live Control Room. Now open Flash Media Live Encoder. At the top menu, click File and Open Profile. Navigate to where you saved the profile and click Open. If you have a number of profiles, note the time it was downloaded to find the correct one. Click OK on the Profile Validation pop-up. In the Video section at Device, click the drop-down menu and select the camera or device you will use. In the Audio section at Device, click the drop-down menu and select the microphone or device you will use. Adjust the input and output windows to 25% so they can both be seen together. In the bitrate section, adjust to 400 kilobits per second with the output size 1280 by 720. Tick the box Save to File, then click Browse, then name the video file to be saved, and then direct where it will be saved.
then click save. Tick the box DVR Auto Record. Click the start button and the encoder will start streaming to YouTube. Minimize Flash Media Live Encoder and navigate to YouTube Live Control Room. You should see a good stream status. Click the preview button. A pop-up menu will ask you to confirm the command. Click OK. The preview button will then be replaced with a start streaming button. When this turns dark blue, you can click it when you're ready to start the stream. A pop-up menu will again ask you to confirm the command, click OK. No streaming to your YouTube channel. You can view the stream on YouTube, but if you expand the Flash Media Live Encoder, you can view the input and the output windows and keep an eye on the encoding log at the same time. To end the stream, click the stop button on the Flash Media Live Encoder. Then click the stop streaming button on YouTube live control room. Then click OK to confirm the command. You will see the stream status, no data.